What up, what up, what up? This is Nappy Girl Kitchen. And so today we're going to do some um, homemade chicken salad. So I bought a turkey roast from Kroger for $4.99. They were on sale. Y'all have to excuse me because the onions been burning my eyes. I was cutting up onions. Um, and I took that turkey roast. This is for the young people. Again, this is for people who do not know how to cook. This is to give them some nurture, some cooking lessons so they can cook and provide for their children and not have to eat out every night. It's very easy. You take that turkey roast, $4.99 from Kroger. I said a turkey roast is just by Butterball. Uh, you cook that in your crock pot overnight. Um, make sure it's halfway full of water. In the morning, you get up, you cook that on low heat. In the morning, you get up, you cut that off. Go about your day. Do whatever you need to do. Um, come back. And then the turkey's going to be nice and tender. And you're able to shred it up like this. Which just, I shredded this up with my hands only. Okay. So, now, I cut up uh, a half an onion and one celery stalk. I used two, two tablespoons of salt. And I'm dumping that in there. I shredded all this up with my hands. That turkey it was just that tender. I'm using a fourth cup of relish. And I'm using two tablespoons of honey. And you can get you any kind of honey. But if you want the real honey, you know, I understand. But a sweetener. You can use sugar. You don't have to use honey, but... I like to use uh, natural sweeteners. And then we're going to use um, mayonnaise. I like the mayonnaise with the olive oil in it by Kraft. I love that. So, we're not going to uh, mix and match. We're going to rinse that off. And me... For my mayonnaise, this is what I do. Tablespoon, start stirring. We know that a tablespoon is not going to be enough for this. I didn't use a lot of onions, although I love onions, but I have a, I have a child that doesn't like onions. And see, by you sweetening this, by you buying the turkey roast, you're going to get white and dark meat. So, uh... By you sweetening this, you can you can eat it with saltine crackers. You can eat it with Ritz crackers if you want to. But um, here we go with another one. That's two. And I don't like my food real mayonnaise. -y. I'm not a mayonnaise -y person, so <laughs> I don't. Eat. And this is my towel that I wipe my hands off with. But you know you can. We we trying to do this for the young people. Use stuff that you have in your house, but you can add grapes, you can add walnuts, you can, I mean, anything you want to do to spice this up. But for me right now, I'm just doing the basic for y'all so y'all can see how to make homemade chicken salad. It's so easy, Lord have mercy. Like I said, a butterball turkey roast, uh, put that in your crock pot, fill it up halfway with water, season it, probably about two cups of salt. Because you got a whole little roast. Let that cook overnight in your crock pot on low. Come back in the morning, turn it off. Let it cool all the way down. Come back, shred it up with your hands. Cut you up a half an onion if you like onions. A celery stalk. Uh, a fourth cup of relish, sweet relish. If you don't know what relish is, there it is. That's sweet relish. And then I did two... Um, tablespoons of honey and I think I'm going to do three tablespoons of mayonnaise and we're going to whip this up because this is a quick meal for me and my girls and if you want to you can make a turkey melt with it on toast with cheese for your babies this is a way so these young girls can feed these babies and quit putting these chemicals in these babies feed them so they can use their brain the right way. So, Shazam. 
There you have chicken salad. Homemade chicken salad. That's it. Nappy Girl Kitchen. We in here.